Is your house currently for sale and you've got one of those really ugly new price or price reduced stickers out front? Then you need to listen to this video. Usually when you see new price or price reduced stickers on a sign, there's usually one or two typical reasons. Number one is the house is overpriced. That's what we say usually as real estate agents to one another. It's not new price. It's overpriced to begin with. And it's probably overpriced for a couple of different reasons. In this market, I find a lot of sellers are picking their, their selling price out of the air and they're not doing their market research. Or in some cases, they're adding car loans, student loans, credit card debt, you name it, to the price of the house. And that's not how things work. Just because I owe the university a lot of money for my education doesn't mean my house is worth more. I'm also finding that uh, agents are listing houses for unrealistic prices to appease the seller because it's a lot easier just to say yes Mr. and Mrs. Smith no problem we'll put it on for that we'll try it but the fact is you're probably wasting valuable time if you're not doing your market research find out what has transacted look at your competitors put the weight on what has sold and adjust your price appropriate to how long you want to be on the market by looking at absorption rates. That would, be, that would be how many houses are on the market, how many houses traditionally sell in a month or a year, that should be able to calculate how long your house will be on the market. Additionally, the other part of the, the equation is, every time an agent asks you for a price reduction, ask them what they've done to market that home and see some proof, see where it's been. Has it been on social media? Have they put out the, the just listed price reduced postcards in the neighborhood? Uh, have they posted on certain websites to get lots of traffic? Maybe they co-listed it with an agent that has a massive marketing program. If you're going to give up uh, a few dollars in the new price, or if you're going to lower your price, Negotiating 101 says, find out what else they can do to maybe put a little more heat under the burner to market that property and get it above the crowd. There's hundreds, if not thousands, of properties for sale. If you're just putting in an MLS, putting up a sign, and then praying it sells, chances are that's not going to work as well as an aggressive international marketing campaign. I'm Michael Posnick with Century 21 Northumberland. This year we're giving away an iPad. To join the contest, go to iPad.michaelshomes.com.